Hey guys, Rashid here from r and Alright, I'm gonna check out Dimash doing SOS at the Slavic Bazaar. This one is on his channel. Alright, let's check it out. Обладатель Гран-при международного конкурса исполнителей эстрадной песни Витебск 2015 Димаш Кудайберген, Казахстан. Кудайберген. That's how you say it, is it? Love that accent. Wow. How can you be an angel and a beast at the same time? <laughs> right? Kodaibergen, Kazakhstan. I love that. I love the language. Bravo. Who are they? They zoomed in again. 
Похоже, сегодня Басков без цветов. Сказать пару слов от всей души. Хочу поблагодарить вас, дорогие зрители, за то, что когда я участвовал на славянском базаре в качестве участника, помогли мне trying to get my camera back for you guys. There we go. Yes. Damn, he talks low. The Luridanis. Luridanis. The Luridanis. Wow, he's got a deep talking voice. I'm surprised. Man. I'm shocked. That explains his low notes then. And his big thick operatic sound. Wow. I like his talking voice. Let me hear that again. Jessica. Yeah, it's pretty deep, man. Far out. Cool. All right. Let's. Uh, isn't that weird though? <laughs> like I watch him sing so many songs, but I never actually heard him speak. All right. Um, let's check out some of my favorite bits. Do some analysis. Like who starts a song like that? Seriously. <laughs> So beautiful. Stunning. Now, I'm gonna say, don't get upset at me, but I, I think this was a lip-synced performance. Um, just because we watched a fair few of his now. I don't mean edited, I mean like lip-synced, as in he wasn't actually singing. Just from the way the sound is on the record, it sounds like a recording, if you know what I mean. Like um, the effects and the volumes from watching, not just this part, like the whole song, from watching the whole song. Now, don't get upset. That's just what I think. But you know I love Dimash and you know I love his voice. So it's not about, oh, you know, he can't do this. I know he can do everything. You can't fake that stuff and perfect it in recording because th those kind of tones can't be faked, right? And I've heard him enough. Oh, man, my camera... So just letting you know that, that I do think that, just letting you know that I think that about this performance, but it doesn't take away. It, it actually sounds super incredible, like the recording. So if I was to go listen to the recording, I would, I would be like, wow, you know, it's so beautiful. So, and you saw like my reaction, it's not fake. So I really enjoyed it. Oh, is this camera? Oh man, I'm really having, some camera issues today and I don't understand why I don't understand why at all it is very frustrating I'm sorry guys just be patient with me while I figure it out please all right I'll get in again excuse me please sorry okay here we go There we go. Let's see if that works now. All right. <clears throat> Those lows, man. She so thick and rich. Nice. Now this phrase is ridiculous how it goes from low to high. And now, switch. That's a big switch, man. Far out, what a big change. 
in one phrase. Just showing you how hard it is to copy and like what it sounds like in my voice, more more basic sounding, especially on the highs. Um, oh, one thing I want to add about the lip syncing, like the reasons for lip syncing usually for artists is not that they can't do what they do in the recording. It's usually that they do a lot of performances and they have days where they're just not feeling as well. So they might do a lip sync and sometimes they're forced to by the actual venue that they're going to for whatever reason. So it, it really does depend. So please, again, don't take it as me thinking that he's not capable. I think that last one was a chest note. I think. It's hard to tell, it's so rich. Yeah, it sounds like a switch to chest. I can't even tell, to be honest. But, yeah. That was crazy, man, that effect. Wow. that very Arab sort of run, Arab Turkish, whatever it is. Whoa. E and F sharp, five. Wow. That hold. Oh, what a do. Whoa. Stunning. Oh, wow. to be <laughs> except he's doing an octave up <laughs> I'm doing that one <laughs> crazy right <laughs> that's the notes of the run That's how hard it is. Except it's much harder for me to control it. E and F sharp. So before he belted them, and then he does them in his nice falsetto sound. It's like on the limits of my falsetto. My falsetto doesn't go beyond really G5. Really nice long phrase there. Whoa, see. She Finished on E6. Damn. <laughs> He's acting right so good. <laughs> See there, the timing was a bit out. That's why I was saying like lip syncing because I saw a few things like that.
that note, man. B is very high, but to him, it doesn't sound like it's that high. And the power, that he, the volume that he puts on it with the vibrato, it's really epic. Let me show you how high it is in my voice. Uh, uh, that's how high it is. <clears throat> See how high it is? It is morning for me, so I can't really sing really high at the moment. But even normally, that, that note would be like on the limit. And I could, couldn't make it sound that thick and rich, so this is extremely hard to do. Oh. That was D that time, D6. So beautiful. Gave me a little shivers there. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed my reaction and analysis and I'll see you next time. Bye.